hi good morning everyone let's get started with the next topic for this training which is sizing for SAP GRC in this topic we will see how do we size the system properly because there are a lot of components involved here and we need to make sure that we size it just correctly okay so before we get into sizing let's revisit the architecture so you have NetWeaver 7.2 zero ehp2 okay these are the component that is access control process control risk management and you have the different rtas plugins are here and these are the end users which are accessing okay so this is the architecture that we are going to size it so select factors that influence the performance so what are the factors that we influence so number and type of target backend system so how many systems we want to connect so it will depend on that so for risk analysis for access provisioning for role generation for super user privilege management okay so this is one factor business requirement like total number of objects in each of the backend system for access analysis total number of risks and rules defined for access risk analysis average number of permission level violations per object in access risk analysis number of average roles per request and number of average systems associated per request here you can see that the number of more the number of systems you'll require the bigger size and more the number of roles you'll require the bigger size so Make sure that your roles are properly designed so you don't end up in thousands and thousands of roles. So just make sure that the design should be pretty good. The number of risk depends on how many risks are there, how many rules are there, how many firefighter IDs are accessing the backend per hour during normal business hours. Number of access requests, how many new users or new requests coming in maximum number of concurrent real-time access risk analysis jobs number of objects in each real-time access risk analysis and disk size depending on the number of violations frequency of ad hoc analysis etc it also depends on number of clients also so sizing of access control version 10.0 is based on the following assumption okay so we will show you the t-shirt sizing that is the sizing which we can use it as a base so we will be showing you this assuming that we have say 50,000 rules risk analysis rule set sizing of only access control version 10 server is provided okay database is included within the sizing so for small that is one to three backend system with 10,000 users. Medium is like you have between three to 10 backend systems and 25,000 users. Large, you have 10 plus backend users with 50,000 plus users. Okay, so preliminary sizing guidelines for access control version 10. We have minimum disk size, minimum SAPs. Okay, so for a small system, we require a disk size of about 400 gig and saps is 2000 saps so we will see how this saps what this saps is and how we call this as a sizing measure okay so for medium size 600 gb space and 4000 saps and large 1000 gb and 8000 saps so for any sap system it is sized in the number of saps required so SAP stands for SAP Application Performance Standard. So the application performance standard is a hardware independent unit that describes the performance of a system configuration in SAP environment. So you have SD benchmark, okay, that is 6000 dialog steps and 2000 postings or 2400 SAPs. So this is how the the benchmarks are created and defined and they are used in turn to reflect into the capacity 
Okay, so that is what actually I wanted to present in this particular training. Thank you for joining and have a nice day. Bye-bye.